Hello ducklings, welcome back to Auntie's Castle. Today at Auntie's Castle, it's gonna be a little bit different because it's not just all about playing. Sometimes it's about learning, but learning can still be fun. But before we get into it, make sure you like my video and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any episodes. Knowledge makes our brains so, so big and it helps us understand the world. Today, I want us all to learn about people that have disorders or special needs. Do you know somebody in your life that has special needs? For example, maybe it's somebody that uses a wheelchair or needs special glasses or maybe it's another classmate that has a special tutor. It's important for us to understand that even though people have special needs, they're just like us. So the first thing we need to learn, ducklings, is that disorders and special needs can happen in so many different ways. Some you can see and some you cannot. Like, oh, this person needs a walker to walk, or this friend needs to be extra wiggly at his desk to focus. Maybe someone with special needs has to wear a hearing aid, or maybe they communicate with their hands. So sometimes people have special needs with their moods, and they get really upset, or really sad, or really angry. Sometimes somebody with special needs struggles with their speech, so they can't say their words as easily as we can. Some people have special needs that makes it so hard for them to learn. Their brain just takes a little bit longer to understand. Here is Marcus, he's legally blind, so he has to wear glasses to help him see. Arabella has cerebral palsy, so it makes it hard for her to walk. Damien has brain dysfunctions. Xander struggles with his moods. And even Duckling Maverick has a disorder called NF. It's very important that if we see someone that has special needs, we don't stare at them. Staring is not polite, but it's okay to ask questions. It's okay to ask about your differences. The main thing we need to learn here, friends, is even though kids with disorders look differently or sound differently, they're still just like you. They still like to play with the same toys you play with, watch the same movies, they like to hang out with their family and their friends, and they just wanna be accepted. A lot of the times, the people with these disorders, they live their whole life like this. They don't know any other way. So we don't need to feel sorry for them. We just need to accept them for who they are and understand that they also have strengths. We all have superpowers and specialties. If you learn anything here today, ducklings, is that we love and accept everyone, no matter what makes us different. It's those differences that make us special. Thanks for learning about disorders and special needs today, ducklings. If you wanna learn more, make sure you ask your adult at home. Before you go, make sure you like the video and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time at Auntie's Castle.